just a quick update, I guess. Friday, August 13th. Um, I was hoping to have my work training stuff taken care of, but I, I um, the person I was supposed to interview with um, for the final one fell ill. <laughs> so it's just, it's continuing to push my official start date later on. So I'm like, okay, just, you know, going with the flow and, and I wish this person well. And um, yeah, I mean, I'm not stressing out about it. Um, if anything, I feel a lot more confident in the training information. I'm going over it. I'm making the time, you know, because it's been like over six months that I, I jumped into this world again. And so I'm becoming more familiar with just the flow of things and, and just kind of taking things as it comes. I'm, um, I'm taking this, this as a sign of the universe, like, you yeah, don't worry, <laughs> just go with the flow. Um, you know, I, I'm going to use this time to like continue to, you know, uh, clean my space. I'm almost done. I feel good. I'm, you know, eating healthy. I'm, I actually, I weighed myself this morning and I was surprised. I was like, oh, I lost three pounds. <laughs> I don't know if that's just the extra walking that I'm doing or just, you know, the movement of stuff. Um, I got a little homesick last night and, and I called my sister and so that was nice just for a brief minute. And, and um, but other than that, like I just, I, I, I feel more settled for sure. I feel more, more settled in, in, even though I haven't started work, um, in the flow of, of what I need to do, the expectations, um, and, and just my physical space is coming together. And so I'm just going to use this extra time. Um, cause then that last appointment isn't until the following Monday. So I'm like, okay, I got, you know, the weekend <laughs> to continue to explore and, um, to, and, and that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to continue to just settle in, explore, um, and, and just kind of see what unfolds for me. And, um, yeah, so, um, which is not what I expected. I expected to be done and, and to work tomorrow cause I, I, I'm scheduled to work, um, a couple of days out of the week, full days and then Saturday mornings. So, um, I think I had a dream last night, but I, I can't remember it. And it's funny because I'm, you know, I, I haven't meditated. Maybe I'll do that today. <laughs> Maybe I'll meditate once I find my stuff and, and do my spread. But, um, uh, in lieu of that, I, I've been, of course, following, you know, MJ and, and Allie and Dana and Chris and, um, for tarot and, and, it's funny because some, some of the stuff that they share is stuff that I'm posting on my videos for this week um, or this weekend. The videos that I'm preparing, <laughs> so I'm just like, oh, and they're to that to the point where I'm like, I don't even need to hear it, right? Because I'm past that now, right? And, and still focusing on being in the moment and, and um, just going with the flow and expecting that things are going to fall into place. And I'm not worried at all. Like I. I don't even know where I stand financially, but you know what? Fun's gonna come in, <laughs> everything's gonna flow. <laughs> I feel good, I feel rested, I don't feel stressed. I think that's the biggest piece of this whole puzzle is that I don't feel stressed. And, and not even jumping into this line of work again, like I don't feel stressed jumping into it which is great. And I want to make sure I maintain that for myself. Um, and that's one of the great things about this agency that I, I really appreciated was their promotion of this work-life balance. So I, I'm hoping to be able to honor that for myself, for my clients, for anybody around me and um, continue to live my best life as much as I can. That was it, just a quick update. <laughs> um, yeah, all right, talk to you guys later, bye. My name is Yubi, and in case you haven't figured it out, this footage is capturing my 
experience as I learn to navigate my personal spiritual awakening. Um, I am learning that this experience is unique to each one of us um, in whatever way we believe we are embracing living our truth. This just happens to be my journey. Um, and despite me having a graduate degree and a license in clinical social work, this by no means is intended to replace any type of mental health advice. This is just me on a personal level, uh, documenting my experience, shedding light on the truth that I am learning and discovering for myself, um, and really inviting you along for the ride. Um, if by some <laughs> magical chance you find this content to be helpful in any way, shape, or form, please click the like button, you know, share the message, subscribe to my YouTube channel. I have an Instagram account, a personal one, and one specifically for this channel that you're more than welcome to check out. Um, I'm an open book. Um, I have also created t-shirt um, t-shirt designs. I'm wearing my favorite one right now, which is the North Node. Um, uh, design, um, but I have that and other things uh, that you can look at um, inspired by this process and journey. Um, and I have the link in the description box as well as in the about section of my YouTube um, channel. So you're more than welcome to check those items out. Um, any type of support is, you know, great. <laughs> um, again, if, if you find this content really helpful or meaningful, sometimes when we um, take that step and, and be vulnerable, you know, with, with showing what's inside our hearts and what's really our truth. We realize that we're much more connected um, than, than what we thought we were. And so um, I hope that um, as I'm living this experience it, and you, that you find some type of truth for yourself or, or find some type of um, ability to heal in some way just by relating, you know, just just by knowing that you're not alone. That really has been my goal with, with this process, um, not just um, being able to connect with others, but really for my own healing. Um, it's definitely been a therapeutic experience and a very creative one for, for myself. So I thank you and um, I wish you all the best and, you know, we'll see what else um, comes next for me. So take care.